What about the next one? In the next. Hell, Carlos is already pushing me to rope camp. Camp Pioneer? There's no proof of that. What the hell? They're moving. Did you see? I heard one of those radio free origin broadcasts. Claims they got hit by Richards. Now you're listening to that. Something's wrong. What <laughs> the fuck is that? But I think he'd know a ripper if one was coming at him with a butcher. <laughs> hey! There it is. I just gotta find a way inside. You see anything? <sighs> hey, you! Crap. What the hell are you doing there? about the next group, Mike, and the next. Hell, Carlos is already pushing into rogue camp. Camp Pioneer? There's no proof of that. They're moving up north. I heard one of those radio free <laughs> Someone's here. What? There's no one here. Hey. Yeah. Who's out there? <laughs> Can't help. There it is. Just gotta find a way inside. Why? You trying to get with them? Hey there. That did it. Something's not right here. Two seconds later. How come that? Something feels wrong. Ah, oh, damn it. <laughs> Hi, Ricky. Hi, Addie. Uh. I don't want any trouble, so if you ladies just step aside, I'll show you. No, 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 what the hell are you doing in my infirmary? Oh, are you gonna shoot me now? Oh, wait, wait, there's a code, right? You can't shoot a woman unless you have to. Well, now you have to. Ah, shit. Okay, look, why don't you just let me explain? Check what's in the cooler. What are you selling narcotics for Tucker now? You know, when you brought me that girl, I thought you had changed. But clearly you haven't. No, it's not narcotics. What? It's antibiotics. Boozer's sick. He's got blood poisoning. I had no place else to go. Blood poisoning? What happened? Does it matter? I fucked up. Bring him in. Go and get him. Bring him here. No, we can't do that. Yes, we can. Look, I don't care who he is, and I don't care what Iron Mike thinks. When a man is sick, a man is sick. We have to look out for each other. Baby is all we got. Come on, I'll give you a ride. Which way we headed? You remember there was a small camp when we first rode into the valley? Yeah, I remember. You call this a bike? It may not be a fancy drifter bike, but it gets the job done. Get on. How's she doing? The girl that I brought in, Lisa. Are you, are you gonna take me to see her? No. God damn it, Ricky. What, what the hell? Why not? I can't. She's not here. 
wait, wait, hold on for a second. Where is she? A few days ago, Schizo assigned her to a scavenge run. She and three others headed over to the rogue camp to look for supplies. They came back without her. You're telling me they left her? They left her out in the shit? They didn't leave anyone. They said she ran off. Jesus! It could have been anything. Wolves, freaks, rippers. Choose your poison. And what, what, what was Schizo thinking sending her out on a supply run? Everyone's gotta work, deep. That's the deal, and you know it. I don't believe this shit. Look, she'd been surviving in Marion Forks for years when I found her. Yeah, then maybe you should have left her there. Who's there? Hey. Get back, don't make me blow your goddamn Who's head there? off. It's me. No, get back! Oh. Hey. Hey, it's, uh, it's Ricky. <laughs> you remember me? I rode with you guys a year ago. Ricky. What? Tumalo? Yeah. That's a... Tumalo to... Goss Lake? Yeah. Yeah, oh, man. Hold on, hold on. That's right. How, how you doing there, loser? You doing uh, all right? PG. It still didn't give you the right to steal our shit. Are you kidding me? Look at his arm. What was I supposed to do? Huh? I don't know. Maybe ask. Jesus. Look at you guys, the biker boys. The most badass drifters in this shit, right? And now you come back crawling to Iron Mike. Oh, wait. If you let you. <laughs> come on, just help me get him back to Addy. Let's go. Come on, Bill. Let's don't need your help. <clears throat> Yeah, Boozer Ricky. Wait, where, where are we going? Addie said... She's agreed to, to take a look at your arm and, and see what she can do. What? No. No, you're not taking me to some goddamn camp. I can ride, damn it. We're not sa Damn it. Boozer, it's just for a few days. Get some shit for your arm and then... No. You know what it's like there, Deke. No, you're not thinking straight. This isn't the Hot Springs. This is Lost Lake. Iron Mike. Remember him? Iron Mike? He's gonna get us killed. He said... That was a long time ago. They built the place up. They, they got more people. We're all gonna fucking die. We'll be long gone before anything like that happens. Camp's got the only dock in a hundred miles. Now, Addie, just look, she'll take care of it. Just, just a couple of days. Yeah, then we ride the hell out of here. Right north, like you said. Get the hell away from all this. Yeah. Yeah, we ride north. Leave all this shit behind. Okay, so I'm gonna go back and check on him and make sure he's okay. Coward. Yeah, you got that right. Well, how long? And until he can ride, I mean. You mean how long do you have to be here? Look, we have antibiotics, but it's not enough. If Iron Mike lets you stay, your friend will have a chance. So what happened? How'd he burn his arm like that? We ran into some rippers south of Belknap. Guess they didn't like his tattoos. Jesus. I've heard about him doing shit like that to themselves, but not to people they're trying to recruit. <sighs> Boozer wasn't any goddamn recruit. I uh, guess Tucker should have made a deal with him like Iron Mike. Come on, Ricky. He just he doesn't get it. 
Carlos isn't going to honor any deal with Lost Lake, not for long anyway, and Mike, he just doesn't see it. He sees more than you think. You've always had your good side, Deke. You've just been doing your best to kill it. Thanks for the vote of confidence. You cannot believe a word he is going to say. Addy is soft. Mike, we do not have enough for those that pull their own weight, let alone a goddamn cripple. He's oh, not a cripple. On. He can work. He... I say we throw them out on their asses. Mike, that is not who we are. Jesus, listen to you. And you, you tired of being Tucker's little bitch, finally? Raymond, huh? stop it. Don't call me that. I'm pretty tired, all right. All right, See? enough! See? You know who the fuck this guy is, and you know what he- You hold on! And you! You put that shit away. Mike, Deacon was I one that know. brought me the good. I know. And I know what kind of man he is. What he's done. He done any worse than you? Ricky? How about me? We've all been out in this shit, Schizo. We've all done things we're not proud of. We need another rider. Oh, now, wait a minute. I just need a few days and some antibiotics. I'll do whatever it takes. Sure, Mike. Whatever you say, I'm on board. Walk with me. Don't you. start with me. So you're the one who brought them in. I didn't bring them in, Schizo. Boozer needed help. But he broke into the infirmary. The tackle shop isn't exactly... Ricky secure. told me you stopped you running for Tucker. That weeks ago. Sent that little girl oh, here so instead. You're hooked up with I'm sorry I lied so to you go before about doing box. runs for Tucker. Isn't that your job? How long no, you been drifting? Not my job. You and my Bill. Job I don't know. Like I said, time gets lost. Your folks don't put down some roots. Figure this shit out. Grow some food. Come next spring, won't be none of us left. If you give Boozer what he needs, let us hold up here till he can ride. Like I said, I will do whatever you need. I just, I, I want you to know that as soon as he's patched up, we're gonna put together some gear, we're gonna ride north. North, huh? There's a camp up there near Smith Rock. Boozer's never been there. Anyway, got a lot of ghosts down here. It's time we move on. Fresh start, eh? Yeah, I can respect that. Now go on. Leave me be. I got some thinking to do. Sure, Mike. Yeah, whatever you say. Just have Ricky radio me if you need something. <laughs> 